Seeing a dolphin in the bay or the gulf is always a special experience. We know them to be incredibly intelligent, yet there's still so much to learn about the species. Recently, a new study revealed dolphins may possess the sense of electroreception, and this could change how experts or you view them entirely. Let me tell you, I've been doing this for 25 years, and this is new to me, and as I'm talking to peers in the industry, new to them. Kelly Martin is the VP of Zoological Care at Clearwater Marine Aquarium. She's talking about a breakthrough study by scientists at the Nuremberg Zoo in Germany who believe they've discovered the sensory ability of electroreception in bottlenose dolphins, the very ones who populate the Bay and Gulf ones that are cared for here at CMA. Yeah, this is fascinating, but it really hones in on the fact that these animals are more than we could ever imagine. And like you and I, they just really have this unique way of being able to adapt to their environments. Electroreception is known as the ability to sense electric currents in the water, and dolphins could be using it to okay. avoid predators, find food, navigate, or even communicate with one another. Ready? So let's yep. put these in the water. One sensory ability we already know dolphins have is echolocation, seeing using sound. And they emit sound. It bounces off of objects in their environment. And after that sound bounces off an object, it returns to the animals in their lower jaw and their inner ear. In this test, Kelly and her trainer show us that when his ability to see is taken away, Nick the dolphin can swim across the pool. And as Kelly and I hold three different objects, Nick is able to correctly identify the one his trainer wanted him to. It's now a red boat. So he's moving his head back and forth. He picked the right one. Good job, buddy. Wow. Wow. Kelly and I shuffled the toys. The trainer identified different ones for him to choose. Let's see if we can get it right. And a superstar. Great job. And he kept acing the exercise. I asked Kelly that if during her career she can point to anything she's observed that might explain dolphins using electroreception. Good job, bud. Nice job. She spoke of dolphins in her care with hearing impairments, like this rough-toothed dolphin. That's Rudy. And wonders if maybe this provides an explanation for certain things he can do. We have had situations poolside where we will provide a stimulus, a tap on the water, a tap on a wall, a movement of a gate system, um, maybe just throwing a toy in the environment. An animal who can't hear definitely responds. So how is that possible? Could this be a part of that? Potentially. Nice job, buddy. Another clue in an ocean full of mysteries. Stop, appreciate from afar, and know that there is still a lot to learn about these amazing animals. And I feel like we're only in the beginning stages of what we can do and how we can help each other. I put a link to the full study conducted by the Nuremberg Zoo on abcactionnews.com.